Hello, FM. Today is Thursday, March 19th. I'm Jack. I'm Aaron. I'm Nick. I'm Ben. I'm Sophie. I'm Michael. For most of us, online instruction starts today. So make sure to check Schoology and your email for information on how to get started. Make sure you reach out to teachers for your email if you need help. This is new for everyone, so try and remember that in the words of High School Musical, we're all in this together. And we're going to get through this with hope and kindness. Over 160 families rely on the FM Food Pantry for meals. It is hard to visualize, but there are people affected by hunger in our community. You can donate items to the Food Pantry, which is located on 122 East Seneca Street on Mondays and Thursdays from 10 to 11.30. You can also bring items to the Manlius and Fayetteville Libraries whenever they are open. Monetary donations are also accepted. To find out more, please visit fmfoodpantry.org and help us fight hunger in our community today. Thanks, Nick. As of today, Food Service implemented a grab-and-go breakfast and lunch service so that students who participate in free and reduced-priced meal program have access to nutritional foods each day schools closed. Eligible families who have not signed up for the grab-and-go meal service should contact the FM Food Service Director at catering at fmschools.org. Please indicate which school is most convenient for you and whether or not transportation will be an issue. Families who need to retrieve personal belongings from schools, such as musical instruments, will be able to pick up these items from 11 a.m. to 3 p.m. today. And if you're already bored, here's our awesome LMC staff with some ideas for staying smart. Hey, FM. This is Ms. Petrolis coming to you from the quiet side of the library. Actually, every side of the library is quiet today. Um, we thought each day we would bring you some information to keep yourself smart while you're staying home and isolating. Um, and also something to do to keep you from going crazy. So the first thing I want to do is uh, talk to you about how you can um, use library resources digitally even though you don't get to be here physically. So if you go to the library website, you'll see that Mrs. Kleckner has provided you with instructions, step-by-step -step instructions, very easy to follow on how to check out an audio or digital book using Sora. So you can see that she has created a slideshow that is uh, very um, well illustrated and shows you step-by-step -step instructions. It's super easy to do. You don't have to come into the library to get a physical book. You can actually read one on your phone or on a device at home or listen to it. The last thing I'd suggest is get a notebook, any kind of notebook. During this crazy time, even if you just write a few minutes a day and talk about the things that you're experiencing, witnessing, and that's going on, You'll have that to show to your children someday and your grandkids. It'll be a really interesting written record of what your experiences were during this most unusual time. We miss you so much. Hope to see you in the middle of April. In the meantime, we'll be on FMT TV. See you next time. Well, that's all we have for today. Stay tuned for the next FMTV.